Ooh, do I have a story for you? Hey guys, my name's Wendy Valencia, and if you are new to my channel, make sure you click that big red subscribe button down below and go click that bell notification icon so you don't miss a thing. Cause today I'm telling you stories about crazy people at the bank. True story. This really happened. Today, while I was at the bank setting up the Girl Scout troop bank account. So while I was sitting in front of one of the managers at the bank, this woman walked in and she was dragging a suitcase and she threw it down on the floor. It made a huge thud and she proceeded to very loudly humph and gruff and ugh, she sounded very irritated. She unzipped her suitcase and flew it open clothes literally went flying and i was like okay what's going on here and as it turned out she had been at the airport and was trying to buy some sort of plane ticket to go somewhere obviously and was denied because her account had been shut down and from and now mind you i am literally sitting on the opposite side of the bank from this woman and I could hear everything she was saying because she was screaming it. So basically what I determined is that she had bounced a few too many checks and they had closed her bank account and she was not able to take this trip that she was trying to take because her card wouldn't work. And in her mind, this was somehow the bank's fault. Awkward. I sat there and literally while i'm sitting there i'm actually kind of plotting out what i'm going to do when this woman launches herself across the teller's desk and does whatever she's going to do i had i had literally like plotted out i'm like okay so she probably hasn't seen me where i'm sitting i'm gonna crawl along drop down under the desk crawl along this floor and if i go up to this wall then i can lunge at her and take her down yeah i'm that girl <laughs> <laughs> so I, while I was planning this out, I got to thinking to myself, wow, I have never wanted to give somebody a Dave Ramsey book so much in my life. Now, while after listening to this woman, I, I'm guessing she had some sort of like mental issue going on because you bounce that many checks and they shut your count down. You gotta at least know it's partially your fault. At least in my mind, you do. Maybe in her mind, she didn't think it was her fault. But I really wanted to take her and say, listen, there is a way that you can do this. And while with her, it probably would not have worked. I have realized that I need to carry Dave Ramsey books with me wherever I go. <laughs> So anyway, I know this is a super quick little story time. I just, I wanted to share with you like just something out of the middle of my day. And seriously, I kind of felt sorry for her because finances are tough. I mean, they can be really tough. And if you're not on top of your money, things like that happen. Anyway, I thought y'all get a kick out of the little story and I don't do story time very often. Just just so you know, this is just something random that happened that made me very thankful for Dave and Dave's plan and how, well, nothing like that has ever happened to me. I, we don't, we don't have financial problems to that extent. Some people do. And so I am just thankful we are where we are in our lives. And so thankful that we have discovered Dave Ramsey and his plan because we really are able to move forward in our life. And we're going to be very financially stable in the long run because of it. I mean, Mauricio is in his early 30s. So by the time he, he's just starting his career. So by the time he retires, you know, we're going to have most of his career debt free. I mean, how awesome is that? So anyway, if you are new to my channel, make sure you click on my big laugh and face to subscribe and I will put up two videos so you can keep on watching. This video up here is my latest one and this one right here is one YouTube picked out just for you. So I'll see you in the next one. See ya. See y'all.